decided to move to LA to throw herself into the music industry. Oh, looks like the move paid off. You from Salem, Elise. This is Lonely Child on the Edge. railway station and stuff like that and across the road there. This Leviathan Hotel coming up. A lot of truckers stay there. Like they will have their rigs and all that parked along here and they stay here. It's one of the oldest hotels that we have in Dunedin. It's the only one I know of that hasn't really changed name and it's really creepy. I've been there a couple of times. There's a few places that always has the New Zealand flag. That's the Otago newspaper that has it there. And it even says it. Star. I hate this pub because I know Chef is a fucking prick. But Stuart Street that's known and like down there is the railway station. And that was Cadbury's that they're making at the whole hospital now. Yeah? See how that goes. The children, they don't have children. What are you up to, mate? Really? There's a park there. Community house, they're pretty cool. Like, if you have any issues, they can help you with tenancy issues. Just anything in the community that you need legal help for. Because he's a, uh, um, don't run over that lady. Fuck. I wanna stay away from that murder lady. There's a seagull. <laughs> Fucking didn't even wanna say hey.
Do I look like a terrorist or something? But yeah, I've got to do a few locations today. But yeah, that's going to be the new hospital. It's going to be massive. But yeah, no, like the free massage parlors in Dunedin are seriously like all right around the corner from each other one has a sauna a fucking i don't know if they've got the spa pools they had a, they had a massive spa pool like there's actually a room downstairs in one of them that is a spa pool but they just put a bed over it but then there's a big spa pool upstairs I don't know if they've done it, but they've got a plunge pool, but it's cold water, and I think, ugh. Well, they're just cesspits. There is a hotel here that, um, it was called the, uh, it's changed a few names. And it's actually got a, it's huge, it's like, fits eight people in it, but it's called the, like, the glow room. Because it literally probably does glow. But it has stars and shit on the roof. I've been in there and I'm lucky. I'm like, now, as I'm older, I'm thinking, ugh. See, the, up there on the, the bank, it's got the New Zealand flag. And in the octagon, which you can't see, it also has the New Zealand flag. There's always like four buildings that have New Zealand oh yeah see that's the police oh no that's not the police I don't actually know what that is because the police are right here you see the centre city one is anyway and if I go here this is the watch house this is the see this is the watch house of the Dunedin inside police officer, police, hopefully it's not a cop, he'll get, but yeah, they've got a New Zealand flag, but it looks a bit lump, just some pride, fucking oh, hell, that's first church, you would have heard me talk about a church before, you can just see the point sticking up, But it was only when I started taking note about, yeah, so you can see the Capri still, but still there, but it's all there, isn't it? Oh shit, gonna get myself run over. No waste, no want. Lady. Oh, actually, they got two flags. Sorry. There we go. There's First Church. You can see it right in the gap. Because right down here, this street here is the Octagon, and that's where, like, they have a whole thing of pubs. And right here was one of my favourite pubs. People we used to come here and buy wine and drink it like there's bushes along here and around the other but they've cut them back. But if you get caught here around this area with an empty like an open bottle you're getting heaps of shit. Look at the sky, isn't that beautiful? Alright. I better go do one of my things I gotta do. Oh, 
and then there's that's the Optigan flag right up there. It's got a big cross on it. It's actually a controversial statue of Ron Optigan. Oh god, please don't ask me. Alright, come to Pitt. How are you going today? Very good. Oh. Don't want someone tripping up on me. Look. Sniffers! Mother's Day's coming up. Anybody want to buy me Mother's Day card? You should be buying spikes, mate. See, this is New Zealand, especially. That's a beer you should drink if you are uh, from Otago. I think they quite like that. They quite seem to human. It was a box and it was done. I've tried this, this isn't this isn't bad beer. But they started doing these you guys all know this because you're drinkers. It's fucking. This sort of shit. Uh, it's like wine in a can. Fucking hangover in a can to me. See, I love artwork, so I'll try that if I drink. Kingfisher, that is really nice beer. Yeah, now you see, this is cool because they've got all these different kinds of beer in it, which I think is cool. If you want to try different beer, I thought this one did too. I like the ones that you get a bit of. Hey, look, there's four packs of spice. Fuck you, it's what? The likes of these ones, how cool is the artwork? Oh, I don't even. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> They don't have the wee mini cubes there. They're actually quite big, aren't they? Fuck, I hate cider. That just reminds me of the hangover. Oh, this is cool. It's got like all different flavours in it. They're expensive, but yeah. One day I'll take you to a liquor store. Probably get kicked out because I'll be like, what the fuck, the price? Bakery. Nom nom.
at the price of food is crazy. do some shit so just wanted to show you see price of sausages crazy right 